hello friends my name is vikrant singh and today i will show you how to use transaction in stored procedure so let's start just open mysql and go to new query tab here i am using demo1 database so write use demo1 here demo1 is used. the tables are in demo1 is user details and the column are user id username first name last name gender password status so we, i am making a stored procedure I am making a stored procedure to update values of the user details. Update underscore value. My procedure name is and the parameters are in user and where care type. Is 255 and user ID is user type and out is status variable. Then 200. Now begin the procedure. Here I am starting transaction. So right start transaction. Here I want to update details of the desired user ID. Set user name is equal to the input here where user ID equal to this user ID right here now we want to print now commit the transaction it will save the transaction will show the status if the user details are updated successfully now print the status Here I am ending the delimiter and delimiter closed. Now I have make a procedure. So run the query. Here procedure update value one is created. So procedure update value one call the procedure.
create new query tab and call the procedure call update value one and the parameters are I want to change I want to change this value 3 user 3 username so I am giving parameters 3 comma user id Background and for output status now run the query here I put username first and user id next to the username so we have to write first username and then user id now run the query here the change update is successfully and the change is third Vikrant again if you want to change here on fourth on username Rajiv so write here Ricky and the user id is 4 now run the query here the message printed updated successfully and the changes is very key here so thanks for watching